<laughs> John says, so do you ambush at dark? Yo, I, I feel like the king... Um... Is kind of weak and has not very many people on his side. I think, uh... I think we have the king outnumbered. <laughs> Did you see that? One of our pygmies asked if it was King Penny Pinch, and Monk lowered the taxes even further. Well done! I cleanse you of all evil! Kraken, in Devon, what say you of the king? Indeed, is it better to be the king or to tell the king what to do? <laughs> you do get a rather sweet sword as the king, my lord. Well, he's so tiny, we could simply say, give us the kingly blade, and he will. Pygmies, kill that animal! That's right, destroy the animal, kill it. Yo devil, thanks for following the channel man, that does get us a little bit closer to 2000 follows, which unlocks Chivo number 2, the 24 hour marathon, so big ups man, thank you. Shall we speak to the uh, denizens of the land as we journey back to the keep? Dude, thanks for following. You've also helped toward unlocking Chivo number two. Big ups. They simply have their goods here. My lord Kraken. My god, what has happened here? It does look as though they have been besieged. Perhaps there used to be walls around these goods. My god. Quickly, look through these chests for anything good. There are some wooden sandals if a pygmy is still naked. Yo, Gunslinger, thank you for the follow. You have also helped toward unlocking Chivo number two. Would someone mind running the Chivo command so they can uh, learn what they're helping out with? I'd appreciate it. Hope everybody chilling on the yeah. infinite couch is having a good night tonight. I'm uh, not as interactive with chat as I usually am because the game's so involved, but hopefully you guys are enjoying. Is there a light? Oh yes, the pygmy has a torch. As night draws, we should head back to the keep. Verily, I think we should speak with the platinum gaming oh, yeah. on the way home. It's not due to lose more pygmies to another werewolf. Indeed. Or an angry kraken. Ha ha ha. I scattered my friend's brain. You're never in too good of a position to gather flight. Very true, very true. Some folk wisdom from Endevin. Pygmies, come with us. Hold, there were two of you. Where's the, where's the other one? Uh, 
Oh my, we've lost a pygmy. It just, it, they are people of the woods. They will find it, its way home. We must travel. Our standard bear, where? Yes, our standard bear has fallen behind with the other pygmy. They must catch up. We cannot be seen to return without our standard. It would be embarrassing. No matter, we must continue on. Yo, what up, Hala? How's it going? You say we should stop by these platinum men. I like the idea of collecting flax with a halberd, you know? Ah, hello! We seem to be getting separated in the darkness. Kraken, we must stay together. It is only us now. there oh good good excellent we found another pygmy but we do not have the standard bearer though he is a man of good resource so let us travel onward. Crack and lead the way. You are the pathfinder, and I know where nothing is. I must say... Who have we here? Pygmies, look through it, see if they have anything of value. You may smash a few things as well if you wish. Very good. Dude asks, when do I start streaming? I don't really stream on a schedule, but uh, I'm usually live at around midnight on the East Coast or 9 o'clock on the West Coast. I usually go for like 6 to 9 hours. This way. Game. Ah, we shall visit them on our way home.
Yo, what up, Goze? How's it going, man? Alright, so Sir Kraken says that this is another clan, Platinum Gaming. We're gonna talk to them, I guess. I hear voices. There's someone home. Hello there! Oh, Goze says say hi to me. Now you look like a dick, because I did. <laughs> Why don't you say hi to me, Goze? Damn. Demanding. Hello! Who goes there? Who are you? We are Knights of the Order of O. Oh, hello. We have come from speaking with the king. It is us who caused him to lower the taxes. It goes well, though. None so grand such as these walls, my god. No need to have your weapons. Are you naked in there? Hello? Have we interrupted, yeah. milady? My- oh! No. Oh my, and I hear a gentleman. We, we perhaps can come back at a more fortuitous time. Uh, that would be wonderful. Oh, oh, continue your business. We, we shall see you. Pygmies, come with me. Quit staring. Come on, stop looking. No, no. Hide his eyes. Very good. Oh my! Kraken, you dog! We must blow horns of fornication! Kraken, you meant for that to happen, didn't you? I was not aware that this was a keep of debauchery, my lord! Oh, the sin and debauchery, indeed. We must leave this place. Ah, the standard bear, hello! You, I must say, you missed out. Thought you lost forever. <laughs> Savannah says, oh god, please Dave, I'm dying. Yo, this, yeah, this session is really funny. <laughs> We're having a great time. Slaughter the animal, pygmies! Oh, look, he's beaten you to it! Uh oh. Hang on. The client. Grundle has earned a cookie. Sheepy, we, um, visited some of the people of the land and accidentally uncovered a gentleman and a lady having some alone time. Kraken, lead the way, my good man. I was distracted with the chick the Let us pick up the pace. Come now, come now. Lil Pimp says, man, what the hell have I missed? Yo, man, this is one of the streams that I recommend. If you miss parts of it, you should just go back and watch the stream. Uh, the VOD will be up for a week, and I'll put it on YouTube so you can watch it forever. So I definitely recommend checking out this stream after it's over, for real. <laughs> it's like every, like all of it has been awesome. It's ridiculous. This game is so fun. I don't know why this game's so fun, but it, this game is so fun to me. So if you have no idea what's up, uh, we have a guild on the server called the Order of O. 
We have a keep we're building over there on that island. And we're on a roleplay PvP server. So we just went and met the king. And we got the king to lower taxes. The king was actually tiny. Uh, it was a very tiny king. And now we're returning home. And we'll plan our next move. In Devon, Kraken, as, as men of the blade, what say you of that king's strength? Do you think we could take the throne? Um, I think it might be a little suspicious how easily toppled he is. Perhaps we will wait and build our strength and have him as a puppet king for now. Yes, better to have him the target of assassins than one of our own. Indeed, perhaps we could even get him to give us donations from the taxes. Look, it appears we have come across a couple of lowly peasants. Oh there! Peasants? Hello? Peasants! Pygmies, do not hurt them! Pygmies, do not hurt them! Hello! Are you... Are you new to these lands? It is okay, you do not need to fall upon your knees. Do you see the keep over there? That is ours. You may live in these lands freely. But if, if you displease us, we will have to slaughter you mercilessly and repeatedly. Understand? Very good. And you may consort with our pygmies as well. Do you see them? They're very tiny. Pygmies, dance with them. Very good. <laughs> uh, Grundle, dance with them. What are you doing? Put away your whip. Taste the sting of destruction. Ooh, very well. Well, we have work to attend to. Pygmies, enjoy. I cleanse you of all evil. Look, look how eager to work our pygmies are. They run straight to the job without even asking them. They are well trained. I know some of y'all are enjoying my ample lord bottom. Look at that gluteus. This game is so fucking fun, dude. <laughs> Such a good time with it. My god! Where is Guru? He was in charge. I saw him. Guru! Where did Guru go? Behold, he has built some sort of stone thing. My lord Guru, what, what have we here? This shall be a tower, you say? Oh, I see. And then we can enter the tower and shoot at the gate. You must make a fortified way to get into the tower from within the keep, of course. It is a wise plan, Guru. I knew you would be the great engineer. Very good, I see him above. Hello. Hail, my lord. We have met with the king. We have convinced him to lower the taxes further and discern that he is a weak and tiny man. Ow. 
And what is this, Guru? Explain it to me. <laughs> From the life of the earth. Guru? No one can escape the bringer of death. Explain to me this gate contraption. Not my, my god. Quickly, someone must repair the wall. It is strangely bugged. Very well, very well. Let us all gather within. Are there blocks right here or am I just tripping? Oh, I see it's like an extra layer. Is that the point? I'm not sure. I'm gonna take these. I don't know why they're here. Is this like bugged or is this really a block? I'm like confused. Yo, I think my game's bugged out. Would somebody take a look at the gate and see if it's like actually blocked in? Is it actually blocked in or no? I can't really tell. My god, it flies in the breeze as a show of our power. Let me put these away then real quick. Boom. Oh yeah, I had some other random shit I picked up off the peasants as well, remember now? Let me put that away too. And I gotta feed my character, he's starving. I'll get the meat cooking over here. Boom. Very nice, very nice. Let me eat and drink. Yo, what up, Bean? I hope you have a good day at work. Uh, you have missed an amazing stream so far. Like, you should actually watch the VOD, for real. You'll really enjoy it. You'll laugh your ass off. It's been such a good RP. It's been so fucking funny. And our keep's coming along. Like, we don't have as much stone walls and stuff as other people do. Uh, but our keep looks the coolest so like guru do you see what that wall looks like on my stream the gods above I is that what it really looks power. like IRL yeah that's what it uh, yeah. like that's what it looks like so is there like two layers for is that for extra protection I think it's from when I uh, took some blocks out and then put them next to it just because I was uh, heading out and it looked like other people were going to come out. Oh, I see, I see. When I take it off, though, does it look all fucked up to you or is it just me? Sometimes. It, the walls, like, possessed. I might need to restart my client. Alright, I'm like scared of these blocks. Here, take it, Guru. I'm scared of it. I'm scared. Yo, what up, Killa? How's it going? Alright, y'all. I'm gonna restart my client real quick and then, uh,.
What do you think the next move should be? What do you guys want to do? We got the monk to lower taxes. I think we should start going ham on building this tower. I like what Guru's doing with the tower outside. Pygmies! You must collect goods for us. We need all the resources you can find. Can you do that? Nod wildly if you can. Oh yes, oh yes. Very good. Lords, Guru and Devon, Kraken, Standard Bear, Sheepy. My cat friend, you must gear yourself up. I shall do so immediately, my lord. Very good, very good. Guru, you're doing excellent work on the engineering of the defenses. In Devon, Crockett, you've done excellent scouting work. The meeting with the king was flawless. I believe now we must do some building, continue our projects. The pygmies will bring to us resources and goods. Perhaps we should send a god with the pygmies when they're collecting, if someone would like to do that. I may do that. But I feel I must restart my client, my friend, so I will be back shortly. What is this client? Wizardry, my friend, you would never understand. Yo, do you think we need blocks behind this door too, or no? Yeah. Okay, cause okay, I can have a couple where they at. Gatsby goes, what's the hierarchy? I think the order of O works like this. The pygmies gather resources and they, they're only bossed around because they like it. They like, like to be bossed around, they enjoy it. Then the lords are like all the dudes in armor. And we kind of as a body make the decisions. But Childric the Wise kind of has the lead, you know? That's me. Uh, but he's not like a king or anything. He just, uh, he's wise so they listen to him. You feel me? Oh, nice. A lot of people have moved their beds. Allow me to remind you, make sure you move your bed up here as well if you've not done so. Yo, Killer, thank you for following. That does get us uh, a little bit closer to unlocking Chivo number two at 2000, which is a 24-hour uh, marathon. So big ups, man. Thank you. I'm going to restart my client real quick here because... I think I'm getting block bugs because the client's been running for so long. Dude, people are going ham. It's just awesome. So, how you guys feeling, Infinite Couch? Are you enjoying uh, the Reign of Kings? Is it fun to watch, y'all? I think it's awesome. I really enjoy this game. Please forgive me a little bit. I'm going to drink some tea before I log back in. I've been doing a lot of silly voice. <laughs> Looks like we got some new faces because of the game and uh, probably people looking for role playing. So I hope you guys are digging. Welcome if you're new. I do recommend take a look at the info down below the video. Uh, if you're feeling it, man, hit me with that follow. I'm trying to grow the channel. Let me refill my tea, actually. Give me just a second here, y'all.
All right, all right, cool. Let's hop back in. <clears throat> of course, if you want to join in, man, love to have you. Um, the order of O accepts most. Uh, we're playing on the Forgotten Coast server. And uh, they're down, as you'll see here, with PvP, RP, and beards. So. <laughs> Lil Pimp says, I follow, but I did it when he wasn't streaming to avoid attention. I wonder how many people do that. Because they don't want to get called out. I just like to thank y'all. Because, you know, you don't have to follow me. Nobody's making you, bro. But I try to do the Chivos to, like, celebrate, you know? By the way, if you like my stream, you'll probably like other streams on Team No Pants. There's a lot of, uh admins and twitch staff on there but uh they're all very chill streamers by the way let's do an informal poll who has pants on right now on the infinite couch who in chat has uh pants on right now i don't all right let's see if relogging fixed the uh, that weird thing that was happening with the gate in the front St. Bastion says a sharp stone hidden in your orifice. Yeah, you do have an orifice slot. You can put a sharp stone in your butt. And uh, if you get captured, then you'll be able to uh, cut through your ropes. You can actually put a lockpick in your butt, too. So I'm just getting a weird bug with blocks. I don't think relogging fixes it. I just think it's an alpha thing. But it's chilling. Yo, Guru, for real, that tower is badass. That's a good idea. I like that even better than the gatehouse. And it'll be less resources. Yo, Sheepy, you want to do something real quick? Do you want to go ahead and do you see how the walkway is, like, too wide? And then there's that, like, extra thing we put in front of the gate. You want to just connect it right there? You see what I mean? So it looks kind of like a T. You can do that real quick if you want to. Alright, who's got no pants? Everybody has pants on? Yo, I'm ashamed right now. I'm ashamed. I don't have pants on at all. So I'm trying to decide the next moves. I think I might actually go ahead and just focus on expanding the tower. My good cat. Are you finding a way around well? The order of row grows. Are we missing an archery target or am I hallucinating? Is there just one here? Or are there two? There are two. I do not see I one here. You say there is a archery target right here, where I'm standing. Alright, allow me to, um... I'll be right back. 
All right, I'm going to actually shut down my whole client because that last time all I did was log. So let me actually shut down my whole client. It should fix it. Whoop. Yo, that journey to meet the king was awesome. It was so fun. And of course, finding some people like, you know, cybering. That's good too. <laughs> Chemist asks, are there ladders in the game? I don't know. I don't think so. I literally only see uh, one archery target. So, Guru, are you fucking with me or are there really two there? It is gone. Okay. Where did it go? Maybe someone picked it up on accident? I don't know. Well, I could craft another one. Perhaps I will craft another. We need hay, flax, and wood. Alright. I probably can have to go harvest the hay. You're holding a bow for me. What are you supposed to be holding? <laughs> a bow. Okay. But there's this floating hammer. I positioned myself to... Oh, I don't see a floating hammer, but I saw one earlier. You're having a vision. Gyrate, Guru. In celebration. Blessed life, I call forth! I do not see a floating hammer. I am not... Blessed this time. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and craft the replacement archery target. I guess that one disappeared. Uh, what is it? 125 hay, 50 flax, 250 wood. So I should have 50 flax and 250 wood real quick. Okay. Gentleman says Guru's gonna be a blacksmith. It was a sign. Yo, exactly. Yeah, we actually have hay too, Holler. I forget how much hay it was, but whatever. I'll just put the rest back. And Devin says maybe the targets break after so much damage. Yo, that's actually probably true. I think you're right. I actually think you're right. And Devin, I think you called it. But it's cool. I built another one, so we're straight. No worries. I'll go place it right now. Very good, sheepy. You have a knack for building. You should beautify the grounds. For real, anyone who wants to do little decorations, like if you want to add windows or like shutters or put torches around, like we could really use some lighting. Go ham, dude. I don't care as long as you make it look cool. You know what I mean? I'm probably going to go ham here in a second and add like at least another floor to the tower and keep building that up with clay. Big Mies, you're doing well. I might take the pygmies on some uh, resource gathering trips too. Try to protect them. I say, sir, children, do you have any flax on you? 
Indeed, my sir, I have a lot. I meant to put it all away. Here, I'll give you everything I've got right now. I thank you. Alright, my friends, I'm going to oversee some construction of the tower. Everyone is doing quite well. Guru, if you need any help, let me know. I look forward to your tower, my sir. Sheepy, I know you do well making this place beautiful. Alright, so I think we'll take a little break from the running around and role playing for a while. We did that for a couple of hours. We'll put in some more work on building the keep. Uh, for some of you guys, you're probably brand new, so I'll show you a little bit. This is our main gate. Uh, we have blocks behind it because right now you can glitch through gates pretty easily. So uh, we kind of have to take out a block and then go in and then you see what I mean. Um, that's true of like every door in the keep. So we got our little crafting area over here. Back here we got the smelters and uh, storage for that. I still haven't decided what will go back here. Probably something cool. We might wall that off over here, eventually, and make this into like another area back here. Maybe a place to sleep more people or something, but for now it's just like a little yard. Um, I'll take you guys up on the walls. We got a little archery range right here. Ooh, Chemist says that should be a dungeon. Yeah, that's a great idea. We'll definitely make that into a dungeon. That's a good idea. Yeah, we're going to make that into a dungeon. Great idea, chemist. All right. My good friends, a spirit in my head has told me this rear area is to be a dungeon. Please pass on the word so no one builds anything else back here. All right. Anyway. Um, go up on the wall. So we got an archery range. Come around here. The surfer I says you need a sex slave dungeon. No, that's the platinum gaming castle. We went over there and there was a girl and a guy naked. It was very awkward. Uh, so here's up on the wall. Guru did basically all of this with the help of like conservative and Kraken. Um, forget who else helped. A ton of people. Um, the gates down below. We can't really shoot people when they're at our gate right now I'll show you like you have to go the gates down there to the right can't really shoot people from here so what guru is doing is uh, 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 ooh, that was close is a uh, building a tower here that's gonna allow us to be able to go into it through a fortified passageway and shoot at the gate um, I still also might build a little platform forward here with some murder holes um, so that we could have two people, like people can be here with javelins. Now head in here. Can't seem to open the door. I think someone might have uh, replaced that door and forgot to set it back to family. So uh, I'll have to have whoever did that fix it. But in the meantime, actually, you know what? I can pick the door up, I think, because it's in our guild territory. I just have to be holding a block. Fuck, it! how many blocks on me? Shit. <laughs> can I do it with my hands? I can. All right. Someone accidentally placed that door and didn't set the permissions right. Uh, but I can actually... What well, looks like I picked it up. Is it in my inventory and I can't see it or something? Where did that door go? <laughs> that door literally, I think, disappeared. I'm going to have to make another door. Fuck. Ah. Those blocks I picked up didn't go in my hand, too. I wonder if the server is really behind.
You had a full inventory? That's what I thought, but I have a uh, tons of slots open, so I don't think that's what it is. I think it's just a bug. We'll just have to make another door. Guru says the server is done. Okay. So none of that shit I just did happen. Well, while the server's done, I can show you guys in here. Up here is where uh, we kind of have everybody sleeping right now. I've scattered some chests around and we'll put some more. Uh, so that people can store their shit when they like go out or whatever. These are actually logged out players. So when you log out, you leave behind a body like this. And you can actually uh, kill this body and you kill that player and you can loot them. So, want to try to log out somewhere safe. Then down in here is actually our guild crest. So our control of the area emanates out from this crest. Um, and the better the crest, the bigger of an area we have. So... Um, when the server's back up, I'll show you guys the exact boundaries of our area. And of course, we have a ritual fire here. There's some food in those chests over there. Um, and it looks like everyone's moved their bed, so that's awesome. This is a nice clear area to put some more chests or who knows what. We'll spruce it up. It'll look badass in here. I know that Sheepy was going to start doing some work making things look good. Because, uh, she plays the, sh the Sims hella. But that's pretty much the order of O's keep right now. Um, the server is actually down, so I'm running around in a wasteland. There's no one actually here. And there's the order. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. We have ten motherfuckers. So that's pretty cool. Ten man strong. All right. So the server is actually down. I'm gonna have to log out and log back in. Sorry about the technical issues, guys, but Reign of Kings is at a very early stage in the build, so you just got to roll with it. It's a good uh, opportunity to sip on a little tea, though. How you guys doing on that infinite couch? You guys doing well? It's been an amazing broadcast tonight. It's been really fun. We've had some excellent role play. Um... And not just, you know, that's, A, look, you know, at the viewers, like, the viewers of this channel are some cool people, so they did some great roleplay with me. Other people on the server are cool role players too, so, man, the Forgotten Coast server, I gotta recommend it, it's a very cool server. And Devin says it's so silly and conducive to role playing shenanigans for sure. Um, but imagine when it starts to get like solid on the fighting and stuff. That's going to be so good too. All right, let's see how the server is doing real quick. I think we're back. Looks like we're good. So we're going to be chilling here for a bit. Uh, I'm going to be actually working on the tower here so I don't know how much role playing we'll do for the next while here shifting gears a little yo peace salty get some good rest bro um, I might put on some music while I build we'll see ah yes Guru, I believe we should also still have a platform that goes out a bit over the gate with some holes so that we may rain javelins and arrows upon them, as well as from the tower. Do you wish to build that as well, my good man? For the main, the main keep, not just the tower. Yes, uh, if you want to come up top, I'll show you what I mean. By the way, am I hallucinating or is there a block here? Is that a block? This is a block. Okay. Is it gone now? Yes. 
It doesn't appear gone to me, but that's okay, I believe you. Alright, my lord guru. Were I you, I would line myself up. And use the camera where you hold C. Presses the Cth key. And then build a platform straight out over where you would stand if you were attacking the gate. So just expand where we're standing, you know. This little area straight forward a bit. A few blocks, a little balcony you could say and put some holes in the floor of the balcony where we may shoot down through. Does that sound good to you? Yes. Very good, my good man. I will continue building floors to the tower. Alright, but anyway, uh, earlier, I think some people wanted to listen to some chiller, like... Well, basically, here's the choices. We could either listen to Monster Cat, or we could listen to the in-game music when it comes up. What are you guys on the infinite couch feeling while we do some crafting here? Do you guys want to listen to uh, Monster Cat or uh, do you guys want to listen to the end game? Yo, I still see that block, but it is clearly gone. That's such a weird bug. Is this confused? Ah, so the hay I put away was actually, like, simultaneously still in my inventory and actually in the chest. That was really weird. But it sh looks fine now. Let's see if the flax is the same way. Monster Cat's not a band, it's just, um... A music robot that makes Twitch music. It's like a label for Twitch, basically. But it's like electronic music. But those are the choices. Um, Alright. So I need definitely clay to start adding floors to this. I kind of wish I could put a... Like wood on the corners, but I think that would be a pain. The first thing I want to do is build some ramps so it can kind of look like this. So let me grab, probably need three more ramps real quick. Let me hit this clay here. Alright, we got clay blocks already. That's beautiful. And we got over a thousand clay. Alright, that tower is fixing to rise, y'all. Um, yeah, like Sabatum says, Monster Cat is a record label. And they kind of focus on, like, the Twitch market providing... They don't claim any VODs, so... If you use Monster Cat music, you'll never have your VODs muted, so. Alright, so I'll build three of these ramps. Not four of them, three of them. And then we'll, uh... I like to do this because it just makes it look like it's holding up the building. I don't know, it's just like a little... Alright, I don't think that... I think I'll have to do two in the middle instead of one. It's fine, I'll make one more real quick. See, it just adds a nice little touch to it. I think it looks pretty cool. I could even do it like another layer if I wanted to. So I'd need three... Seven total. So as you can see, we're definitely going to be shifting gears here now. Now we're going to settle in for some chill crafting. Uh, I want to work on this tower some more. 
I love that idea to have a dungeon in the back there. So we're definitely going to build a dungeon at some point. We're going to have some gallows and shit outside. We might need to build a secondary wall. We'll have to see. The server could have ate the blocks, but I haven't seen any stacks of them. Yeah, that looks pretty good. Nah, I think I think the rollback got you, Sheepy, because I think there's a shitload of wood in here. I think the when you made the blocks, the server rolled back to before. See, doesn't that look fucking cool? Just a tiny little addition like that. I think it looks good. Um, but I basically want to focus on adding height to the tower. I just wanted to do that little thing. So those windows up top don't have shutters. That's another thing is all the windows are going to need shutters eventually. Um, I took all the windows out on the bottom level because it, that doesn't make any strategic sense at all. And from up here, you can open the windows and attack people in the yard, so. Works pretty well. Alright, so those disappear normally for me. That block bug the server was having was really weird. Alright, then we got... This room, which... Right now, I'm pretty happy with how it looks. I basically envision just chests in the area with like food and drink and things like that. You know, maybe a chest for offerings. And then, uh, I definitely need some more lights in here. Probably some torches around. Maybe put a torch like back here. So it's like glowy or something. That'll be cool. Uh, up here, it's kind of a place for people to stand during the, uh, ceremonies as the ranks grow. So here is actually pretty good, but check it out. These shutters open. You actually can't really see down from here. But you could easily shoot javelins through those, so that's why they, we got the shutters. I'm thinking about eventually putting, like... I don't know, something under the staircases, too, but I haven't decided what. Our sleeping chamber. So we got windows on both sides in here. And then this is what I'm going to be expanding. So. Should be pretty dope. I'm going to add stairs on this side. And uh. There'll be another level. In fact let me go ahead and start that. Uh. I need probably. Right now at least three sets. And if I remember correctly, the stairs over here started at the exact center. I want to double check it. I'm going to fuck around and push someone's body down the stairs. <laughs> push a logged out player down the stairs and he wakes up like on a whole different floor. He's like, what the fuck? Alright, so I think uh, we'll have the stairs go the same way. We'll just have it start here. Alright, um, I gotta make two slots, so I'll ditch my horn for now. Can't randomly blow the horn anymore. Boop. Oh, you know what? Sheepy has a good idea. I'm not gonna cover the windows. I'm gonna put it over here. It's a wise idea. 
So it probably started about that block, maybe? I think the bed's in the way. Curses! What if I started over here in a corner? I think that'll work. I gotta eat. The uh, working is making me hungry. Yeah, I'll just start it back there. Kind of efficient. Go in the corner and go up the stairs. I like it. John says, your royal tapeworm is starving you. Exactly. Alright, so this will be where the stairs go. I'm going to take these blocks out. You just have to have them for now. Alright. Now I don't know how tall I'm going to make this room. I might make this room tall enough that these end up being like double or even triple windows. Alright, cool. No, I'm just going to go ham with uh, adding to the walls. Yep. So I'm literally going to be walking in a square for uh, a while here. Adding blocks. You can do it pretty quick, but I don't want to fall off. So I think I'll go slow and steady instead. Interesting. Sheepy, you have excellent ideas. We shall make the third floor of wood. But first, we must see how large we will make this one. But that is a really good idea, Sheepy have, because if the taller floor is made of wood, if someone is able to hit it with like a trebuchet or whatever it'll be stronger than this clay eventually we'll probably want to turn it into stone or something but the nice thing is you can build and then replace the materials it's really easy to take blocks out and uh, put blocks back in so to speak I see we have a very large banner In Devon, have you seen the massive banner outside? Uh, which banner do you want on the right of the castle there? Yes, it is huge. Yes, I placed that one myself. It is beautiful, sir. I thank you. Sheepy. Do you wish to lengthen those windows down there? I'm afraid if I jump, I won't be able to make it back up.
Yes, yes, just pop out the block uh, above them, so they're taller. Very good, yes, excellent. Sheepy, do you wish to prepare the uh, wooden blocks you were talking about for the next floor? Excellent, excellent. I shall complete this as quick as I can. I can toss you some clay if you'd like to continue that staircase as well. Let's see, there's the... Uh, I wish there was a better way to split this. <laughs> Alright, that should be plenty. There you are. I'm trying to decide how large I want to make this room. I think we're probably getting close to the size. But yeah, I have a block in my hand. Uh, I mentioned this earlier. Do you see that blue line? The blue line shows our guild terrain where we can control with our current... Uh, level of crest and if we make an even better crest we control a larger domain um, so right now we have this we have extra room so guru's making a smaller tower out here um, we're gonna make like a, a platform around there so you have some murder holes above the gate um, but the cool thing is you can build another guild crest and I think have multiple keeps so if we ever get um tired of fucking around here we can build a keep down there or one day we'll take the throne you know we could probably take the throne right now but I really like living on this island so we're gonna build this up we're a, we're a holy order so we're not dreaming after power quite yet gunslinger asks dost thou stream on the sixth and seventh day uh, I try to broadcast just about every day gunslinger so I stream every day. I take days off sometimes, but for me, streaming is a really fun hobby that I'm trying to grow into a, a profession, so I stream every day. Conservative says Monk has been good to our order. It is true. It would be wrong to betray him at this juncture. Right now, we have the king is basically a puppet king. He uh, does whatever we say. We went and told him to lower the taxes, and he did. And then one of our pygmy slaves complained that they were still too high, and he lowered them again. Alright, I'm going to finish this staircase really quick. Make some stair blocks real fast. I wish I had my horn on my hotbar. I would have blown it when whoever was coming back came back. Alright, let me uh, see where we're at. As far as the size here. I like those tall ass windows though. I hope you guys are digging that. I think it looks badass. I think they look cool as shit. I like how Sheepy called it the barracks too. Sheepy's had some mad creative ideas this stream. I think Kraken and Guru are the MVPs of the guild so far though. They've done so much work. Alright, that's coming along pretty well. It's looking pretty good. I think that layer is probably high enough. Now I think we want to go up one more and have that be the ceiling and we'll be straight. I think one more and we'll be good. So like that. Oh my legs! 
Yo, did you guys see that? I did damage to the stairs. I did damage to the stairs because I'm wearing armor. Did you guys see that shit? I literally fell on the stairs and did damage to them with my heavy armor falling body. That's pretty cool. Alright then. So that's what it's going to be here for the next layer. That's going to be the ceiling right there of this current room. So now I gotta fill this in. This is gonna take a mad amount of blocks, but I got a shitload of clay, so we should be good to go. And then Sheepy was uh, getting some blocks together. We're gonna make this next layer out of wood. Uh, and we'll probably put the... Uh... Ho Guru! How go the labors, my good man? Incredible. And I love your outfit. Iron boots, a deer leg, and nothing else. Beautiful, beautiful. Ooh. Getting quite royal. Alright, so I'm gonna... Uh, do you see this layer? Oh god, Guru! Do you see this layer I'm on? This is gonna be the clay stopping point and then we're gonna make the next uh layer out of wood so it's stronger okay. soon man we could probably start making stone stuff too shit is dope oh yeah yeah someone in chat i don't know if you saw but they uh recommended we're gonna make this area back behind into a dungeon <laughs> fuck yeah we'll have to have some gallows and guillotines and shit but they'll probably be outside the walls you feel me Unless we, like, build them and then we build, like, a shorter outer wall. Ah! I don't know. We'll worry about that when we get there. Robo says, can you turn up other player audio if you can? Yeah, someone else asked that, too. It's all the way up. Um... It's all the way up, so I don't think I can turn it up louder than it is without hurting my own ears. Sorry, bro. Yeah, Sheepy. I'm going to fill in this layer that I'm on right now, and that'll be the ceiling. I'll leave a hole for the stairs. And then the next level, we should do wood. You feel me? So it'll have a clay floor, but wood walls. That'll look bad, right? I mean, good. Bad. You feel me? <laughs> Yeah, yeah, hit me with any clay you have real quick. What happened on the other server? What server? Okay, so we might have a server wipe. If there's a server wipe, though, like, I've had so much fun, I'm not even tripping. Because, look, look, for real, hold on. Let me strategize with you for a second. Look, look. If there is a server wipe or if we build another uh, place, what we should do is when we go claim it, immediately build a tower that's 10 blocks tall. Put the crest on there, and then remove the tower except for the block the crest is on, so it's floating in the air. Then build the base around that. You feel me? Because 10 is the max crest height. Yeah, but hopefully we get to keep all this. Do what? Do what? I can't hear you. It's all good. Type it in guild chat, bruh.
Hell yeah! Thanks for the help, Shibi. Ah, okay, so it sounds like that the server we play on is changing hardware to a more stable server. But we do have a possible impending server wipe, which is like kind of a bummer, but honestly, like we know so much more about the game now that, uh, it'll be even better. So I'm not even tripping really. Like, I feel like we know so much about the game. Our next castle is going to be built in like hours instead of days. Yo, Bean, have a good time at work. Thanks for watching. I'll see you when you get home. All right, I need to craft some more clay blocks, y'all. A lot of them. <laughs> Gunslinger says, beating the animals sounds realistic. Yeah, I know from my own personal experiences, beating animals to death with clubs, it sounds pretty much spot on. Let me drink a little uh, tea here, y'all. Do you all chillin' on the infinite crouch have any questions about the game or anything like that? I feel like y'all are just enjoying the show. We might get into some more role-playing later on, it just depends. But right now we're definitely putting in some serious base building. It would be a shame if we lost our shit, but um, like I was saying earlier, Server wipes happen in alpha. You can't trip out about it and just know that all the experience you learn from building Like fucking up like that will make you uh, Just better at the next base you build you feel me it's like uh, It's like minecraft, you know, you're gonna build hundreds of minecraft bases if you play minecraft so you can't trip out over everyone. You just gotta enjoy it while you have it. Alright, I think that's the minimum height right there. Damn, Sheepy's putting in work. I'm glad that there's one other member of the team who's into building and like aesthetics. You know, trying to make it not only functional but look badass. Um... Sheepy's putting in some, some design work here. I'm digging it. I don't even think she's watching the stream. She doesn't even know that I'm talking about how badass she is. Gatsby says they plan in several different biomes. I have no clue. The game's been out like four days now. As far as I know, they're just, uh... Nah, we actually don't need that. Whoops. Alright, I'll fill this in. You can start going ham on the wood walls if you want to. I can take care of the rest Would of this. Would anybody like to have a heart? Yo, I can hear you now. Yo, I need a heart. Why do you need a heart? What are you crafting? He left his uh, I need a heart and three more blood and I can make the, uh, the, like, re... post of appearance thing. The, what is it? The potion that lets you change your appearance? Yeah. Are you gonna become tiny in Devon? No, I accidentally chose the wrong voice when I made my character and I went Ah, to I see. Oh well, Guru's got randomly changed on him. Yo, Sheepy, I was actually thinking keep the walls uh, the same width. So just add it to the edge here. I think we probably got a decent sized room now. Ah! You ate the corner. Alright, I'll fill this middle part in. Gotta make some more of these. I can't remember where I got the heart from, but I think it was from a killed deer. 
Chemist says, if I were there, I'd be all over the construction. Yo, man. Join if you can. I wonder where Conservative got off to. I haven't seen him in a minute. I haven't seen Kraken in a minute. We have some uh, Lords of the Castle who haven't been around in a minute. Ah, Kraken reports that he's been cracking into another tasty base. That's what I love to hear. Ah, Conservative is on a great ranging. Excellent. Just checking in on the health, you know. Making sure you're doing well. Yo, Conservative, guild chat is slash G. And then type whatever. Slash G space whatever. I go on a grand hunting trip. I shall return. Be safe in Devon. Be careful. I'm wearing my sneaking leather armor. All right, I got a. Ah, uh, now he's in Devon wearing sneaking armor. I love it. Yeah, where are these fucking blocks? I'm gonna kill somebody. Well, I got one. Yo, Sheepy, make the walls however high, just whatever looks good. I'm just, that's the goal. Make it look good. Like, these tall windows look amazing. With the moon, look at that. Beautiful. I'm gonna try to make some light for us here, Sheepy. Alright. I need to make some kind of uh, light contraption here. So we can see what the fuck we're doing. You shall not speak of that other game. Alright, let me see uh, what we got going here. What can I make for a light source? We're pretty much out of flax, so I can't really make torches. Um, if I find some animal fat, I can actually make some candles, but I think I might make some of the placeable torches here. They only cost like a couple iron. And I think we have absurd amounts of it. And we got, we're good on iron. I'm gonna go ahead and craft a couple torches that we can actually use to see. I think we might be getting low on wood too. Do we have any excess wood? Our pygmy gatherers haven't been uh, refilling the Oh, here we go. Wood. Actually, you know what? I think I could use hay in the torches. Um, let me try it. Let me uh, see what we can do about some torches here. How much do they... The cheapest ones were seven, I think. Yep. I'm going to go ahead and make as many as I can. Gatsby says Kraken should be Grand Marshal. Yeah, dude, Kraken has been fucking up some bases and bringing us so much goodies back. Kraken's the homie, dude. Alright, uh... Put that back. I'm hoping those three torches will do it for now. 
I need to take him out of the table. Wait, I gotta get my torches. Did you drop them? Where are they at? You dropped them in the table. What have you done? Yo, I think he blew up the fucking torches. I picked up the table to, uh... Try to get him. You ruined them! You fucking dick! Guru's the biggest dick in a... Fuck, now I literally have no way to make a torch for up there until some of this cooks. For fuck's sake. Yo, you made those torches disappear. You dildo. You're not gonna like this. Why'd you turn around? Oh shit, look at him. He must be French with parkour moves like that. Alright, back to work. Alex says, what did I miss? You actually missed a lot. <laughs> like, I've said this a couple times, but this is one of the broadcasts I'd probably go back and watch. Definite worth. Definite worth. Alright, so there's a good amount of light in here, so I'm not really tripping about that. Up here we need some light. So I'm gonna go ahead and put two torches in this room. I'm gonna put them on these, like, opposing walls, probably. Probably put one... Well, let's see how much light that one gives us. Yeah, because they'll be shielded by the uh, stairs over there. Alright, let's see what that does for us as far as light. Let's see. Oh, you gotta put wood in those motherfuckers. Wood or sticks. Fuck. Alright. Back down. Can't wait till they fix the door sink so we don't have to do this block shit. What's in there? Is there fuel like a steel? Yeah, give me the sticks. What do you got? Alright. Let's put the hay away. So Batum says you had like 1,000 sticks. You're right, my good man. Right now we're just kind of chilling and working on the base. Um, all the action happened a little bit ago. We met the king. We went on a royal quest. Everything was fun. But now me and Sheepy are putting in some work on the tower. It's really awesome to have another person helping build. So big ups to Sheepy. Yo Sheepy, if you have an extra log block, could you put it in front of this uh, door down here? I think it only has one. I don't know where the other one went. 
Alright. So, I'm actually trying to help finish up uh, this floor in here. So, let me continue working on that. I was putting up some torches. But it's daytime now, so we don't have to worry about it for a little while. Alex, this is an early access game. It's 20 bucks. The developer has kind of a bad track record, so you should keep that in mind. Uh, but I've definitely had $20 worth of fun. And I think the Osho has too, so... I would say the game is worth... But I know 20 bucks can be a lot of cash. So choose wisely. But if you do join in, man, please come join us. We're playing on the... Uh, Forgotten Coast RP PvP server. They might upgrade to some more stable hardware, and they might actually wipe the server, so all this work will be gone. But, it's all good, because we've learned so much about the game. Our next keep will be even better. But I hope that they're able to successfully keep all the server files. What is that, three more? John says, you didn't put fuel in the torch. Yeah, I know. It's daytime, so I'm not going to worry about it. I'll put it in there later, but if someone needs some sticks, I'll uh, hit them up. Uh-oh, got to eat and drink. Been working very hard. Got to take a break. Yo, Shibi, this is looking badass. Alright, uh, well, the floor is done. Uh-oh. I hear battle. And I can't stop dancing. What ho? Who goes there? Who was it? Who was it? Ah, uh, another of the fresh spawns, trying to come and capture the castle. But you spoke quite easily. Did you speak with him? No. Wh he would not speak? No one can escape the bringer of death! All is well then, Guru? Yes. Well done, well done. Behold the tower. Yours rises quite quickly and well, and look at ours. Quite dainty. This is a beautiful temple. Hello, my good man. We do agree. Well, hello. Who is it you May serve? Pray. Do you seek to join the order? That is the only way within uh, the temple think? walls. Well, I'll just come. I'll. I'll I'll make a trek here weekly to pray, but uh, we're a family of nobles from the north. Very good. Have you met with Monk the Merciful, the king of these lands? Yes, he comes by our establishment often. And what is your he establishment? Came by to the, the fair maiden's place. 
Ah, you have the temple of debauchery, indeed, yes. It was quite upsetting. It, it was quite upsetting. It was very late. Well, I do believe that coming for a weekly prayer is a good idea for one such as you. We must always repent for sins of the flesh. Indeed. Well, farewell. Do you not wish to do the holy gyration before you leave, good sir? He did not. Bless his debaucherous soul. Alright, back to work. You know, Guru. I've had an idea. Ah! My God, man. Do you see the stone lip that extends from our wall a bit that you crafted? Yes. When we have the stone, we should encase a wood wall with a stone one right coming down from the lip. What say you? Uh, fine idea. We will perhaps have to do it little by little, but at the end we will have stone walls and much more protection. Are you going to connect the tower here? That is a wise plan. But make sure it is well defended. I see the cat has returned from its long range. Yeah, look how badass that room looks from outside though. That one's looking dope too. I think I'm gonna fuck with the windows on the second story though. I'm gonna go ahead and put some uh, fuel in there so I don't forget. What up, 12? How's it going, man? Because that's three, right? But they have one between them, I see. We could probably make that all one big window. Is what I'm saying. Like, do this. Maybe have, like, one in the middle. So it's two panes or something. Yeah, let's try this out. Twelve says my internet died during the stream last night. All I remember is a new server about beards or something. Yo, like I've said before, you might want to catch the last couple broadcasts because so much crazy cool shit has happened. Tons of awesome role playing, playing with viewers, building this badass keep. I'm gonna fiddle with this a little bit. Yeah, what do you think of that? They look kind of like a crown. I like it. Sir Dog, we have a visitor. 
Childric. It's Childric. Hold still. Let me come down there. Who is it, my good friends? Who there? Who goes there? Hello there, you have found the temple of the Order of O. What is it that you seek? Chemist? Do you seek to join us? I do believe he is from the stream, my friends. Dance wildly if you are from the stream, chemist. My lord. Indeed, oh, indeed. Indeed, yes, yes. The stream of Aether. He has the moves, my lord. Oh, my lord. Do you see those moves? Someone let him in. Quickly, who is down there? Allow him entrance. We must... See if he is fit for the order, though those are some good looking moves. He has a fine beard as well. Pro says when you talk to these people in game, do they hear you? No. Uh, we're all just pretending. Bring him before the altar. Yo, I've actually got an extra torch I could place right now. Yo, that's gonna look badass. Check this out, guys. Because then I can put some fuel in there real quick. Bring him within. All who are present may enter. There's extra space up above even if you find yourself crowded. So chemist, you come to us seeking to join the order. You believe you have the appropriate moves. It has become time to see if you have the appropriate moves. Show your moves to the flames, and we shall see. Sheepy, blow the honorable horn. Pygmy, blow the horn. My god, it's happening again. Uncontrollable. He appears to have the moves. He does appear to have them. Behold. And he dances unto the flames, chemist. Turn to me. I shall induct you to the order. Feel my power.
You must accept the invite into the order. Very good, and you have made made blood family so you can interact with doors. Let the light of the heavens shine forth. Very good, my friend. I believe you have seen the Aether stream, so you know where everything is. Nod wildly if it is true. Let the light of the heavens shine forth! Very good. Anyone can help you get set up with belongings if you need. And the order grows! Ooh, and in Devon states we have a quest to capture a live Phineas. Sheepy has done quite good work. I'm simply looking for a place to put a torch. I'm thinking I'll add a block here. Indeed, I believe it would be wise to move the beds to the top level of the tower at all times so I would recommend bringing your bed up here until there is a higher floor my god that is quite a bed have you made many more of those behold Another bed. I believe I will place this one. Thank you, my good man. I will try to place it very close to this one so we may snuggle. So I think that you'll spawn at the last bed that you placed. You feel me? I don't think I can. I'll put it in another corner, like over here. Oh, okay, it didn't want to let me place it in third person. There we go. So now I'll respawn right here. Hype. Sheepy, I believe uh, wood would be fine, or if you'd like to use clay, that could perhaps look pretty good too. It's your choice. I have plenty of clay if you'd like to use that. Alright, let me uh, see about putting a torch in here so we can see what the fuck. Hmm. Actually, the torches don't... I forget that the torches aren't like Minecraft blocks, and you can actually put them like in the middle of two, like the. In Devon, do you wish to have backup, my good man? I have no idea where he is. At all. At all. I will come with you to scour the land, but we should travel by day.
I believe I'm as well equipped as I can be. Do we have better equipment than iron now? Could are you wearing steel? In Devon. Can you hear me? I have a plan. Alright, let me light this up, don't drink. Shed some fucking light on the subject here. Nice. Uh, we probably need another uh, torch in here, but that's all good. Probably need two torches per room. Gutslinger says, I realize you could put a rock and a lockpick up your butt, but no cocaine. Well, I don't know how much cocaine they had in medieval times. I mean, they had, like, milk of the poppy. But I don't think they, they knew about South America, you know? They hadn't discovered cocaine yet. Over here starving because I'm working so hard? They definitely need some more torches. Who is this? Oh, we have another visitor. Gentlemen, I returned for supplies to help me capture such a brigand. My good man in Devon, why do we not convince him to visit the temple? That indeed. Then capturing him would be child's play. Huh. I do appear to have walked right through solid block. You are gifted. Yeah, this looks badass during the day. Oh man. I'm digging it. Um So I think Sheepy said this was gonna be the ceiling right here. But I don't remember what she wanted to make it out of. I'll go ahead and make some stairs. I think we might have to uh no, nah, I think what I did the last time was I did corner stairs, right? So we're gonna have to fill in probably these windows here. That's so such a good view. It's a shame. Maybe we'll fill in like one set of windows. Gatsby says, can you actually tie dudes up and capture them? You ab absolutely can, yeah. 100%. Hello, Sheepy. Did you wish to make the floor out of clay? I could take care of that real quick. Or the ceiling, rather. I could do that. You can even build more uh, wood walls if you'd like. Here, I have some wood. I will craft a staircase up to the next floor and the ceiling. And you keep doing your thing. So, let's see, I need, uh, what's that? One, two, sorry, one, two, three, four, five? Let 
there's like different qualities of bindings. There's rope, shackle, all kind of shit. And Devin made the strongest kind. Gatsby says, grab the king. We discussed it earlier, and right now the king does whatever we tell him to. So there's not really a whole lot of encouragement to do that. Alright, um, stairs. That's where my brain was. Stairs, sorry. <laughs> Let's build this up. I like how we have a quest, though. Oh, nice. Sheepy actually has some stairs real quick. Perfect. I like we have a quest. The king gave a quest out to uh, hunt down this Phineas dude and capture him. So we're going to do that. I don't know who all is going. I'll go if uh, I am able to, but I want to finish what we're working on right now. Ah, and Devin, you have changed your very name with that potion. A powerful potion. Who was that? Did one of our pygmies transform into a lord? We must craft more of these potions if they can turn pygmies into lords. Whoop. In Devon, are you still going on the quest to capture Phineas? Do you think Kimis grabbed it on accident, or did he craft his own? Uh, it's entirely possible. 